Health Update with Robin Stoloff, the longest running health feature in New Jersey. We need to make sure we drink plenty of fluids all year, but especially in the dog days of summer. Here to tell us all about it is nutritionist Stacy Veneman. Thanks for joining us. What are some great ways to stay hydrated, especially in this hot weather? Well, one of the most important things is to make sure that you're consuming beverages all day long, not just at meals and at snack time. So I always suggest to my clients, every time you hop in your car, every time you go out of the house, grab a bottle of water, fill up a thermos, always have something with you so that you can sip throughout the day. If you're thirsty, you've waited too long, right? Exactly. That's a sure sign that you're getting dehydrated. Make sure you drink all day long and also be aware of uh, drinks that have caffeine in them, right? Yes, they can actually dehydrate you. So things like coffees and teas and especially sodas uh, are very detrimental in these hot weather sodas months. Sodas just aren't good in any which way. Not just at all. Not at all. <laughs> and what if you're not a big fan of water? What can we do to kind of spice it up? Well, one thing that I suggest again to all my clients, infuse it with fruits and vegetables. Slice a cucumber or a, water, or a, a watermelon or a lemon or an orange and let it just sit in the water. It gives it a lovely flavor. And you can also eat those kinds of foods to stay hydrated as well. Absolutely. Absolutely, those foods all have a very high water content, which will also contribute to your hydration. All right, watermelon, cucumber, all that really good stuff for you. All right, yes. very good mm -hmm. advice. So keep drinking water, stay hydrated. Mm -hmm. Thanks so much, Stacey Veneman. And I'm Robin Stoloff for Health Update. Health Update with Robin Stoloff, the longest running health feature in New Jersey.